In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to change your Roblox keybinds. Now, there's a lot of videos online about how to do this. None of them really work or explain what you actually have to do. So I'm going to go ahead and actually give you a full tutorial on what you're supposed to do and how to make it work effectively. Now, before I get into the video, I want to say please make, make sure you pay close attention to ensure you get every step correct and to ensure that you understand it because if not, you might get something wrong. Now, lastly, I was considering doing a Roblox, give Roblox giveaway. So if you're interested in that, let me know down below and I will then do one in the next video. So that being said, let's get right into this video. So the first thing we actually need to do is we need to go onto Google. We need to go onto Google Chrome or, or a website like that or a browser like that. And we need to type in this auto hotkey. So once you type in auto hotkey, we're going to get a thing that looks like this. We want to go onto this website here. It's going to check our, our uh, browser to make sure it's all safe and legit. And then once we get into there, we're going to download their software. Now, don't worry, I'm going to explain how this all works. I know a lot of other videos don't, so stick around and I will explain that. Okay, so finally this opened up. It took a little bit of a while. I'm going to hit download here and you can download whichever version you want. I'm going to download the V2. And okay, you can open it up here like this and you're going to find where you want to install it to. So select the install folder and then click install and um okay i can't do it there i'm going to just change where i install it to okay that's still not working okay that works so um okay let me try and reload this i'm just going to do that again i don't know why it was to install it there basically just install in the default location of what it's going to act weird okay so now what i want to do is we want to go ahead and click new script and we want to call this anything we want to i'm just going to call this roblox keys like this and I'm going to click create like this and it's created our thing here perfect so now what we need to do is we need to open up this file that we've just made and we're going to right click and I'm going to edit with notepad plus plus you can edit with just notepad if you'd like to so the code they're actually going to put in here is this so this is the code that you want to paste in and basically what this is going to do well, it's going to be in the description. What it's going to do is that basically when this is activated, it's going to look at the buttons you're pressing. So when you press G, it's going to send 6. When you press H, it's going to send 7. When you press Z, it's going to send 8. When you press X, it's going to send 9. So basically, you have to select the key here. So the first one is the key. So say you want to set the key of shift. You can put shift in there. And then you have to put send. So what button do you want it to be in place of? So if you want it to be in place of... Uh, six or whatever key put that the key there then you can save that so now we can just go ahead hit save and that should have saved the file there i'm going to close it and this is going to be ready to run so you can actually run the script and now you can go ahead and actually every time you press one of the keys that you've set it's going to then press the other key so if i press shift now it would use the six key. So that's basically how you do it. Now, if you did enjoy this video and you found it useful, be sure to go ahead and like and subscribe and also comment down below this did work. Plus, if you have any questions about this, let me know down below and I'll answer them as soon as possible. Thanks for watching.